going to go for sure. All right, there it is. The Bowser from Leon, the Falco from Chill Day. No surprises getting into game one here at Collision 2022. And it's going to be on Battlefield of the Small Variety. Very interesting. I like this pick a lot. I actually like this pick a little bit more for Falco than I do for Bowser here. No top platform definitely can be kind of a, a liability here, but this is what I was kind of talking about a little bit earlier. We're going to see a lot of up tilt, a lot of up tilt into imagination here, but the moment that it's misspaced, here comes Leon yep. double there. Oh my God, it hurts. And I definitely am worried a little bit for Tilde at the ledge too, if Leon can get these edge guards. We have, of course, so many beefy hits from Bowser to kind of contest that side B from Falco. I feel like they are kind of playing on each other's shields right now. They are right. kind of like feeling it out. I don't feel like Leon is too confident what he wants to do out of shield first, but the downer fair does come out for Tilde here, but got to watch it. He's going to go for that spike, but it's actually kind of a little bit misspaced on the first one, but I'm sure there will be plenty more to come. Oh my goodness, what a crazy route. Somehow not getting hit by that forward tilt. Gonna go for it there. Once again, another miss face down air. Might be time to kind of drop that. Yeah. And let's just go for some up tilt back airs because <laughs> once again, the scoop from the mid air, you're done for till day. Yeah, especially on the small battlefield here. I don't think you're gonna last very long. You can't make too many mistakes against Bowser. Especially not here. He's gonna definitely capitalize and take the stock. Already at 39 here and oh, very oh wow, how did how did he grab till day that? get the grab? Yeah. He cheated. I just say it. that he's cheating. Once again, mid scoop, mid air scoop. And Leon right now stacked on the damage after Tilde had worked so hard for the first minute and a half to get right. ahead. It doesn't even matter anymore. The okay. tech though from Tilde, that guy plays Wi-Fi. He's used to it. And that Firebird, the lasting hitbox, really working out for Tilde here. 119 and counting though. It's going to be tough. Let's see if we can even it up. Big grab. Oh my god, off the top? Off the top too. Interesting in Star KO as well. So let's see how this one's going to go. I mean... I feel like Tilde now is kind of second guessing himself. Gonna be able though to find the up tilt. Definitely not impossible, but from what we can see, Leon takes an inch or right. like the first opportunity and takes it a mile a little bit faster than Tilde does. For sure, for sure. I think Tilde is getting a little more comfortable though as time goes on. And like we said, it's a best of five, so we'll see what the adaptations look like. Already looking a little bit better. Tilde not taking too much damage on this last stock. That down air is pretty nice. Yeah, the face. down air was very, very good. Leon just trying to find a way to finish it if he wants to. I mean, he hasn't taken too much damage on this uh, second stock of his. Right. Tilde kind of feel like shoved in the corner here. And I actually feel like this stage is probably pretty good for Pelzer now, now that <laughs> yeah. I'm kind of seeing it in practice. But down air back air, yeah. Yeah, good stuff. Really good positioning there to get that back air. It's going to be tough now. Stuck at the ledge. Big back air sends right to the other ledge. Good routing here with the wall jump. Yeah, that was Beautiful, beautiful routing, and I actually really like that turn, Meiji. Yeah, oh, thank you. Yeah, the up air, two nares here, and now Leon, you're in a rough spot. How are you gonna yeah. get back? Oh no, Tilde missed space one more time. The up tilt comes out, gonna be able to live it here. Okay, big forward air from the ledge could be an opportunity here. Leon with a grab though, and that might be it. Sheesh. Honestly, I thought that Bowser up tilt was gonna kill, and I was like, bro, you're worried about the wrong up tilt. <laughs> very, Who very thought? Once again, I feel like. Tilde is like going like 100 miles per hour and right. Tilt and Leon is going 30 and still meeting Tilde at the same spot at like the same time. It's like time. a rabbit and hare situation. It's very true. I know uh, we're kind of like in the middle of a set. I do Wait. want to talk about a couple of upsets though because there are tons of really good ones. Sensei over Non. Okay. Uh, Sensei is self-proclaimed retired right. uh, from this game beating Non. He plays uh, Snake. Uh, Shattuck 3-2 over Syrup. Ooh. So that's Corrin. Once again, we don't have too many of those up there. In Losers, though, Beast over Naito Sharp again, 3-1. Oh, Sharp no. out at 97. Brutal. And Stock Taker 3-2 uh, over Chag and uh, Z over Nuggets 3-2. So there are some amazing sets that I wish were getting some screen time, but of course we are still here inside of this one. Let's see how this game two is going to go, because once again, I know Tilde, he's a little bit happier with, I think, the stage pick going here. Definitely, definitely. We'll see how, I don't know, how, how, how the adjustments can be made from Tilde. Like I said, I think we were starting to see at the end of that first game. So hopefully it will continue on through the set. Already a pretty solid opening. Yeah, for sure. All right, here we go, though. Tilde, I feel like he's actually picking his approaches a little bit better, too. I like the way that he actually jumped out and shot the gun a little bit. Right. He was like, you know what? Let me just get some guaranteed damage here. Once again, Leon is going to punish with the up on the ground. Let's see how he's going to be able to finish this stop because it's looking good for him so far. The 
grab here. So they're going to be able to live. Playing it much more passively off the ledge than we've seen in the past. But once again, Leon going to be able to get the scoop. A huge grab here. And this is such a rough spot to be in. But big down air. Honestly, the aerials from the ledge usually ill-advised. But Tilly's been doing them so well. Leading into some nice combos here. Forward air is going to be it. By the books, by the numbers. Yeah, by the books. Once again, this is the Falco to watch right now. I mean, True. you were talking about this a little bit earlier. The routing that he uh, takes to get back to stage is very, very smart. Unfortunately, though, going to get two frames by the <laughs> That can't be helped, OK? Well, uh, that was a Bowser situation, too. It was like the first hit in air got tough guyed by the F-Tilt. So yeah. it was like, you know, against anyone else. It would have been fine. But back at the ledge yet again. Another good nair from the ledge. This time it's working out. And that, oh, B's going to get punished too. Let's see what can happen here. Big forward air. Nice extension. Bowser off the ledge. Down airs, though, not connecting so far. Yeah, the down airs aren't quite there for Tilde yet, though. I do want to say that Tilde has gotten a little bit better about controlling some of his bad habits. I know the last time I commentated Tilde at Xanadu Homecoming, uh, he was doing a lot of illusions right into shields. And I was like, bro, you can't do that. But of course. Leon, just drop off there. Once again, the thing is with Bowser, I feel like Bowser works so much less hard than a oh. lot of other characters. I mean, yeah. But you do get beat up a lot. It's a bit oh, of a trade-off. Very true. Very true. You definitely have exactly you know what you want to do in most situations for sure. Uh, going too low on Leon or yeah. not mashing hard enough. Right, right. It is gonna be last stock in this game too, looking much better for Tilde. Definitely probably a staging at this point. Leon though still really great on punishing a lot of the things that Tilde is doing very unsafely though. Like a lot of these up the out of shields right. are looking really solid. For sure. And the side B with the parry too. The defensive options Woo! are phenomenal. And the offensive options are just as good. Bows the bomb. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god, Leon. Leon showing that he still got it, man. <laughs> we we miss Leon at locals a lot. I mean, obviously the guy's such a homie, but this Bowser bomb was so disrespectful. So good. Just <laughs> no, so like, mean. <laughs> it covered so many things too because of, like the way that this side B sends. When yeah. you see like that aerial come out, you're like, okay, if he side B's, I'll catch it. If he jumps, I'll catch it. And there it is, That's getting caught. Yeah, you know what? I do think that Tilde does fall into a couple of like automatic habits, like that up air to kind of like, all right, you know what? I got hit. I'm still in this, so let me decide on a way to come back. We're going back to small battles. I don't know how I feel about this one, AG. I am not a fan, but I'm ready to be wrong. We'll see how it works out. I think with some of the adjustments that are made, maybe Tilde can make it happen. That first game was kind of close, all things considered. But you gotta watch out these shield. When you hit Bowser's shield, you know what's gonna happen if you miss space or miss time your aerials. Yep, very true. Comes Leon. Great play from Leon this tournament so far. But Tilde gonna be able to find the double down air. Can't find anything after it until Leon actually goes in a little bit on the shield here. No down air there from Tilde. They're just not kind of reciprocating the love to him. Right. But the back air will always be there for you, and <laughs> exactly. that's a stock. If no one got me, back air's got me. <laughs> if no one got me. <laughs> Honestly, uh, we talked about Tilde's routing, but Leon's routing is also been good. Not getting hit by the down airs. The timing on the up has been phenomenal. And the forward tilts. I said we got to watch out for him finally coming through in this brutal. game three. A little, little brutal there. A little bit. Tilde just really, once again, I just feel like the, the Tilde spice is not quite there. It's definitely there on like his like initial combos, but like the endings are just not there. Right. I love Leon coming down with Nair for the first time because I feel like he hasn't landed with a hitbox like Nair in a little bit. Okay, I like that little shine. Yeah. That's pretty good. This is tough. Even like the percentage is so bad. When you're off stage, Bowser will either murder you with like an edge guard here or just follow up with a different side B if you try to land on high on the platform. See if this back air will do it, not quite. Uh, fine. Yeah, he's gonna stop going for the. Uh, he's gonna stop going for the dares. He's gonna start opting to go in for like a nair fair, which I actually like a lot more. But Tilde, I don't know. The, the sparks are going out a little bit faster here. But Leon looking still as primed as ever, even though he's taken a little bit of break from competing. All right, down tilt. Gonna even it back up 25 percent. If you're Tilde, it's not too bad. Nice. But. Leon probably will, like already thinking about the flow chart. Couple more throws, one good edge guard. There's that Spalco illusion coming through. It didn't exactly lead into anything other than the second fair. Tilde though going to eat a lot of flame breath here, and this could be curtains right here if he were to get the two frame. That was such a good angle though. Going to survive, and the side B missing. What? Oh, Is that air backer? Yeah. I've gotten hit by that. That hurts. 
frame breath, Beauty would again. No two frame there. Tilde, though, going to be able to fight back with a little bit of rage, but is it a little too late to bring this all the way back? The Thank Bowser you. side B is going to take it 3 0. Tilde up in his heels right now. That definitely does not feel good because, once again, I felt like there was so much hard work done from Tilde. The down airs weren't there. Just some of the combos weren't there. And just, you know what? Bowser side B at the lead, or Bowser side B was a pain, but also right. the, the two frame. Yep, the, the two frames were brutal. So good, so good. And, yeah. you know, that's pretty much how we said it was going to go. It just didn't work out. And that that was a re grab anyway. So very dead. Yeah, in that very situation. dead. <laughs> Super dead. Yeah. <laughs> Very, very kind of tough, but like I said, the defensive options from Leon were just so good, which is very, very important when you're Bowser. You have to like uh, that, that's what stops you from getting beat up is like those uppies, the sort of the shield grabs, all of those things are so important. And yep. we definitely saw a little bit of a clinic from Leon. Really good showing. Definitely gonna go on and do great things in the bracket. I'd imagine would not be surprised. We are we getting later Shadow today. Cosmos?